in this video, I'm gonna tell you how we got rid of bed bugs without exterminator because we couldn't afford an exterminator. Besides, simply using an exterminator doesn't mean your bed bugs will go away. And the reason I'm sharing this is so, it's so that you can also permanently get rid of bed bugs without exterminator if you can't afford an exterminator so that you can stop waking up with itchy bites on your arms and hands and going through sleepless nights and being mentally exhausted from dealing with bed bugs but also from thinking about paying the high price of an exterminator so to make sure you don't miss any videos hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you'll be notified every time we make new videos and make sure you get your free pdf titled eight steps to permanently get rid of bed bugs check the description below hi my name is jeremy mongelwa and we used to have a terrible bed bug infestation right here in this bed that's me there in the video cleaning out dead bed bug blood stains from our mattress as you could see there were stains all over and so you know that we had a bad bed bug infestation and we got rid of the entire bed bug infestation without exterminator we couldn't afford an exterminator my goal is to help you permanently get rid of bed bugs too from your home so that you can sleep in peace again so the truth about bed bug exterminators is that sometimes what they spray simply doesn't guarantee that the bed bugs will go away and this is not the exterminators problem you want to make sure you get a good exterminator maybe check around but exterminators themselves from what i've heard they'll tell you that they cannot guarantee that the bed bug infestation will go away by them just spraying. This is the same thing if you use a heat treatment. There is no 100% guarantee. It's not the exterminator's fault. It's if the exterminator did a very good job, there's still no 100% guarantee. And the reason is because the exterminator may not be able to get to all the bed bugs in the house whether they use spray or whether they heat up your house and when they heat up your house you want to be careful because heat damages things and it is expensive we couldn't afford an exterminator and so what did we do we learned what bed bugs were we struggled with bed bugs for about a year and it was terrible it was a terrible time this bed was infested with bed bugs. We used to get bit every single night. My wife would wake up with bites on her arms. It was terrible. She was stressed. We hated sleeping in this bed. It was a nightmare. However, so we sprayed and sprayed. We would buy spray from Walmart and buy spray from uh, other stores. We got spray from our landlord and we sprayed the bed bugs would go away for a while but then they would come back and it was so frustrating comment below and tell me what is the most frustrating thing about bed bugs we thought we were going crazy i wanted to pull my hair out everything was just horrible we tried all kinds of things we tried getting those little lights that say that the light will go out and it will somehow uh, kill the bed bug. That stuff did not work. All we do now is just use that and place it as a night light. And the reason why I'm telling you this is because you may be thinking about going to get some of these things or just spraying alone and it's not working and the bed bugs keep coming back and you don't know what to do. They're biting your kids, they're biting your siblings and it's just a horrible thing. Yeah, I've been there. I've been there and I absolutely hate bed bugs. So what happened then when my wife was so fed up with the bed bugs in this bed and she left me and went to sleep on the couch? I had that. She's my wife. She's supposed to sleep next to me. Because of the bed bugs, she went and slept on the couch. See, the bed bugs 
got in between our marriage. Then it became real. When you're struggling with bed bugs, it gets, they get into your life. You can't sleep. You can get into an accident. Sometimes you're afraid to go to work because you're afraid of spreading the bed bugs. Then you lose out on money. It is a frustrating thing. When that happened, I made a decision. I have to absolutely kill these things. I have to get rid of them. So we had to learn about how bed bugs work. And the reason why we were spraying and spraying and nothing was working, it would kill them. We, would, we, we killed every bed bug that we saw, but we still weren't winning the war. And the reason is because we found out the bed bugs that you see are not the only bed bugs that you have. There are bed bugs lay eggs and they lay a lot of eggs and maybe 20 per day. One, one female bed bug can lay 20 eggs. So imagine if you have 10 female bed bugs that feed and they lay eggs. You have a huge colony and bed bugs, they spread fast. So we didn't know that. We thought bed bugs were like, roaches or some other bugs then ants all you gotta do is just spray and they they'll be gone bed bugs aren't like that it's because they will have eggs in your mattress or in some cranny some somewhere and the bed bugs that you you kill and spray aren't the only bed bugs in your house so the eggs would hatch and their life cycle is about seven weeks so it takes seven weeks for a baby bed bug to go up to become an adult. So if you sprayed in the first week, you will have bed bugs in the seventh week, right? But the thing is that bed bugs need to eat for them to grow. So we were spraying and spraying and getting bit and bit. And so the bed bugs would somehow die, but then they would still come back because the eggs would come back. See, that was the issue that we were going through. And if you're going through the same thing, you know exactly what I mean. But you spraying and spraying and nothing is working. The bed bugs keep coming back. So what's the secret then? The secret was we had to stop the bed bugs from biting us. And that, that is the secret. Stop the bed bugs from biting us. We've got a bed bug proof mattress cover on our bed. We got some bed bug traps. We moved the bed away from the wall so nothing could touch it. We prevented bed bugs from getting to us so they weren't able to feed and they weren't able to spread. And then we started to kill them. We bought spray that, that would kill on contact. So you spray and kill on contact. We bought spray that would kill for a long time. So you'd spray once along the walls, you follow the directions. And then even after eight days, I, th I think up to, up to eight days, it would continue to kill the bed bugs. And that way, whether you're at work or you're sleeping, if any bed bug walks over that spray, it will die. You really need that kind of spray. We also use diatomaceous earth, which is this powder that when the bed bugs crawl through it, it destroys their skeleton and it kills them. The secret to permanently getting rid of bed bugs fast without an exterminator is to do all these things together at the same time. Now, of course, you want to make sure you read the directions because you cannot use the spray on the there to make sure it's earth because then it will make it wet and then it won't work. So you have to follow the directions. But we cleaned out everything. We checked for bed bugs everywhere. Doing these things together at the same time is how we got rid of bed bugs without an exterminator. I'm not speaking against exterminators here. You can use them, but there's no guarantee. And people have gone to exterminators time and time again, and they can be expensive. Depending on how big your house is or how big your infestation is, it could cost you $4,000 to heat up a big house. But even if it's only $1,500, let's say you spent that money, what happens if they come back four weeks later? Are you gonna spend another $1,500, what, $3,000? And when they continue coming back, are you gonna keep on spending that money? People don't, not everybody has that kind of money. And obviously that system isn't working. 
And that's why I created this channel is to help people like you and me who may not have enough money for an exterminator to permanently get rid of bed bugs. This channel is to educate people, to tell them how to get rid of bed bugs because bed bugs are a nightmare. They are a nuisance. When you have bed bugs, you are embarrassed. You are tired all the time because you're mentally frustrated and exhausted and you feel stupid because you don't know what to do. You've tried everything that you know to get rid of these things and they're not going anywhere. It's frustrating. But I'm here to help you. If you're going through this, if you're going through a time like this, if you're tired of bed bugs and you've tried everything or you spent money with exterminators and you still have bed bugs, click the link below, schedule a free video call with me and I could give you some personalized tips from somebody who had bed bugs right here in this bed and now we're completely bed bug free and it's been two years now and I want that for you to be completely bed bug free so you can sleep in peace again so you can get your sanity back so you can feel like your home is your home again and not a place where you just want to leave if you want to know exactly if you want to like the exact steps and the products that we use because sometimes bed bugs get they get used to the insecticide and then it doesn't work and then something new comes along. These are the steps that we took. So click the link below, schedule a free video call with me so I can give you some free tips to help you get rid of bed bugs because they are a nightmare. They come in between your life and your family. It's terrible. And also you get a free PDF copy, eight steps to permanently get rid of bed bugs from your home download it. It's free. You can have peace again. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, like it and subscribe to the channel and, and share it with people who are struggling with bed bugs so they know. God bless.